Hello, everybody. Thank you for taking the time once again for another interview video with another one of our fighters fighting on the 7th of October at Men Menlin Barnyard Theatre at King's K1, number two. Ladies and gentlemen, this is Tristan Labaskachny. He's fighting in the 75 to 81 kg weight class, amateur. He'll be fighting against Sejo Matamleto. I think it is. Excuse my pronunciation on that name. Tristan, how are you doing today? I'm doing very well, Sven. Thanks, and yourself? Very good, very good. So happy to see you again. You are you were at King's K1, the inaugural event. You had a fantastic, fantastic fight against Kevin Nosa. It was one of the hardest fights of the night. Before we go into anything else, tell us, how was that fight, fighting at King's K1, how was it for you after the fight? After the fight, uh, well, on, on the night, obviously, like a big, big adrenaline rush, quite a hype. Uh, the next day, it was uh, a lot of pain and bruises. <laughs> but no, it was, it was a very good fight. It was lots of fun. And I like that it challenged me to, you know, show heart and push through. And, and I'm glad, obviously, to also be able to entertain the crowd a little bit with, with the fight itself. Yeah. I mean, I've, I've seen you fight a few times before in some of the national events and that kind of stuff. This is this was, for me, the hardest fight I've ever seen you have, me personally. I mean, <laughs> I'm sure you've had other fights, but this was really a fantastic fight. Anybody can go back and watch it on the YouTube channel. They will see what heart was actually in that fight. You were like... I was just blown away by that fight. I told everybody that your heart was unmatched in that fight. And I'm looking forward to your next one. So leading into that, what are you doing in camp for this next fight to take on Sejo? So for the next fight, my game plan is more or less the same. Like I said before, I'm a tactical fighter, kind of chess match, like, you know, draw it in, maybe see what he does and obviously fight my fight accordingly just to make sure I don't get caught unaware for something so it's more just stay back suss the guy out a little bit and then as he as the fight goes on then i'll start progressing and start becoming more aggressive and attacking when i see it yeah so i like the fact that you're tactical you come from a very good camp you train there with ashley as well so he knows the fight game and he understands it he's been in the game for a while uh, you guys are always very respectful and stuff like that. Tell me, what is it like training where you are training? And how is it going in regards to your career path to obviously become pro one day? So training here, it's it's very nice. It's close by. I don't have to go very far. Um, we all work as a team because obviously we're one fighting family. So we all work together, train together, live together, eat together, all that stuff. So... Now it's a quite it's a family dynamic, but at the same time, it's when you're in the gym, it's it's gym time. You see, it's it's not. And then yeah, you get your hard sparring, you've got your softer sparring, everything going on there. And as for my future professional, I think I want to like draw out my amateur career as long as possible, get as much fighting experience as possible, be the best possible possible version of myself before I do turn professional. So there's no errors or mistakes or silly things on the night itself. More like getting both myself physically and mentally ready so that I don't hit a blank on the night itself when I do turn professional. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it's a very mature approach to take. Um, a lot of fighters will jump straight into pro, as you say, without the experience, and then they get knocked back down a few levels and might not ever come back to the sport. So it is a very mature approach you take. Tell me, Tristan, we are we are excited to have you back. We, we hope that you're going to be a main fixture within Kings K1. How has it been for you being part of this organization? I must say, you, this, this whole setup, you guys, the whole organization is awesome for me. I've never really seen a competition run as smoothly and on time as Kings K1. I mean, I've been fighting for years and years now. And every time when you do go to a competition, you like you, you, you get told, right, this time we're going to start. And the next moment, you say, you say get there at 10 o'clock and, and the, the competition only starts at, let's say, 1 or 2. Whereas when I was with you guys, you guys actually, everything was perfectly scheduled. I mean, the venue itself is awesome. 
it really it really is a genuine it's a gem amongst the k1 and the kickboxing and martial arts in general it really is one of those fantastic organizations and i really do enjoy fighting for you guys well sure we're blown away thanks for those nice words we appreciate it very much we are here for you guys i mean without the fighters we are nothing so we work hand in hand with you guys um on that note ladies and gentlemen i can't highlight this fighter to you guys enough this is really truly one of the up-and-coming stars in the game very mature level very mature headed in what he approaches the game so yes he's fighting amateur but by no means this is a traditional amateur fight so make sure you come on the 7th of october come and watch tristan fight and on that note tristan what do you have to say to the people that will come and watch you fight on that night no, just thank you guys for tuning in, watching us fight, and supporting Kings K One in general. And just yeah, you guys, you guys are what makes the what makes the sport so good. You guys are what makes the sport. Well, yeah, you guys are what makes the sport in general. So thank you very much, everyone, and I hope to see you guys there on the night. Ladies and gentlemen, from Tristan to all of you, seventh of October, Menlin Barnyard. Get your tickets now. Go to our Facebook page, Kings K1. Go to our YouTube channel. Go to the Barnyard Menland Theatre System. You can get tickets everywhere. Be there 7th of October. Tristan, it was lovely chatting to you again. Good luck with your camp and all the best for your fight. Thank you very much. Much appreciated. Cheers, Ed. Cheers, cheers. Bye.